Hey there. So uh, I went down and shot some video, uh, which you'll see here in just a second, of all the boathouses. So this is just, um, this is, I don't know, maybe 10% of the total number of boathouses that we have in Winona. And this is in a part um, uh, of Winona called Latch Island. It's just across the main channel and across the big bridge, which you'll see later on, the, later on in this video. All of the boathouses, of course, sit in the water on like 55-gallon plastic barrels that are full of air. Um, and um, um, some of them have electricity, some of them don't. Uh, but they all, you know, of course, they float up and down um, because usually there's like four giant uh, metal posts driven into the ground or into, you know, the bed of the river and the boathouses are attached by giant rings which so that the boathouses can float up and down according to the height of the river. Um, and, you know, where I was standing and shooting that video, the, the video that you'll see here in a second, um, that's usually under four feet of water, maybe five feet of water in the spring flood. So you have to canoe to get to your uh, boathouse. But there's people who live there all year round, very content doing it. Uh, and, uh, you know, some of them are really nice. They're like these really, you know, high, high-end cabins. And some of them are really rough, like a shack with a cot in them and maybe a wood-burning stove. Um, so anyway, uh, that's, uh, that's what I've got. Uh, you can watch this video, and if you have questions, let me know. So here are some of the boathouses. So anyway, so here's uh, some typical boathouses that people live in. Um, let me just... That's right, I'm just gonna we'll just walk here to the end and just shoot yeah, some video if that's cool. Oh, nice. You live here all year round? Uh, no, my daughter is living there now. Okay. I lived in that boathouse for 13 years. Awesome. I don't know if you heard that, Greg. This guy's had lived here for 13 years and his daughter lives here now. So anyway, so this is kind of a typical boathouse. Um, you know, they, uh, people, there's some that have electricity like these and there's some that don't. Um, and there's just kind of a whole, uh, have a whole spectrum of lifestyles down here, but mostly it's just people who like to live kind of semi off grid um, and kind of do their own thing. Um, the main channel is actually back that way uh, on the other side of this little island. And then these face one of the back slows. Anyway, um, thought you'd find that interesting. So I was just over there filming those boathouses, not, not those are outhouses, the boathouses were over there. And now my friend Jen and several other of us are going to come down here at the gloaming and we are going to sit our butts right there. Can you see that open, kind of that, what used to be an open spot? Yeah, we're gonna go open that back up and sit our butts in it uh, for about seven minutes. And uh, I don't know, see God, I think that's what happens. Uh, anyway, I hope you guys are all well um, and um, enjoying the warm sun down in Tallahassee. So that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. I don't know. It's getting a, a little bit worse. No, it's not. Carew. It'll, it'll come um, out. Keep yeah, flexing will, your yeah. hands. Yep. Yeah. That will help. It'll keep them from hurting. Because what happens is relax, relax. the cold hits those, those nerves. Next time, I'll be there. I don't find it's bad around. at all with my gloves on, and yeah. I'd rather be in. Right. Know. Whereas I'm just fine right now. Yep. yep. So look, look at yep. look behind yeah, you. It's spreading. not the most beautiful time of day. <laughs> <laughs> the lights on the bridge are on. <laughs> oh. I mean, it's just. It's oh yeah, that is pretty. Beautiful. <laughs> You're beautiful, crew. Oh. Everyone's beautiful. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. Oh, beautiful. I should get the best down here to stand back. <laughs> I don't think you're getting it. I don't think I 
So thanks for watching the video. Um, you, of course, anytime you come up, you're always welcome to go sit in the river with me, uh, especially in the winter time. Um, and if you ever come up and visit, we can actually go out on a friend of mine's boat and we can tour all the boathouses. I mean, tour them as in like drive by them. But they run, you know, when they do sell because there's a limited number and you can't, there, you can't make a new boathouse. You can only buy one that exists already. It's like kind of a big grandfather in kind of a thing. Ooh, Colin's got a cold. And, um, and, uh, and they go for anywhere between, I don't know, 50 and a hundred thousand dollars. I mean, they're not cheap, but, um, yeah, that's the, that's the deal. So, um, I will hopefully talk to you guys soon.